Hi everyone, um, Stephen Klagi back here. The topic of this discussion right now is law of attraction. A law of attraction to attract money into your life. That's the biggest thing. Now, when I say law of attraction, it's actually God's law of attraction. Um, a lot of atheists call it the universe, the universe, and um, I'm a Christian, and I believe the universe is God, and God is the universe. So I'll just call it God. Well. I believe that God has set us on earth, as it says on the Bible, to have dominion. Now, a lot of the teachings with uh, Law of Attraction says that you've got to um, send out signals. And that's basically every morning, if you're a true Christian, you get out there and you praise God and you thank you God for the car you're going to receive. You thank God for the house you're going to get. And that's the first thing I, I came into became a Christian. I knew that Malachi 3.10, you got to pay your tithes. And when I paid my tithes, oh my God, I wanted a Porsche. Can you believe it? And I got a Porsche. I wanted the biggest, baddest Nissan Patrol, and God gave it to me. And I wanted a successful business. God multiplied me tenfold. Like I, In my house, literally, I have not enough space in my house for all my cars. So that's the blessing and abundance of God. And if you want it, you, you pray every morning and you thank God. You already thank God that you've received it. So I want to train you guys how to receive your blessing from God. First, you've got to believe in God and pay your tithes. That's number one. Number two, every morning you get up, you think, you think of that car you're going to drive. The feeling of jumping in that car like if it's a... Uh, if it's, uh, Porsche, which I was in, see this picture, I had the feeling, I was in my mind, I was like, oh my God, me driving Porsche, I was like showing off, I was like so proud, I was so happy, the feeling of driving new Porsche leather seats, and hearing the engine roar, it was just uh, unbelievable, and it happened, and you know, all the blessings you want in life, whatever you want, you already feel it, you believe it, and you receive it, so you must have the belief, when you believe in you're already feeling uh, the, the satisfaction of having it. If you want 10,000 kina in an account, you already you, you visualize and you visualize and you already thank God for the 10,000 that you already received it and you already have that goosebumps in your skin. You feel that goosebumps and you feel that like you say praise God and thank you God. Thank you for the blessing. And at the same time you keep your tithe going because you're just blocking your blessing when you don't do that. So when you start praising God and thanking God, you don't have to be holy, holy, like some people might say. You just have to believe in God, have your one-on-one -on -one relationship. There's a, there's a statement saying that you don't have to go to church every Sunday to be a Christian. It's like going into your garage every day doesn't make you a car, you know. So, in saying that, to get your blessing, to get your 100,000 or your 10,000, Whatever the, your limit is or whatever you think, you think that God's going to give you and whatever you believe in your heart, if you believe it, you receive it. And I believe that with my whole heart. Look at this picture of my biggest, blackest, like, sexiest car that I love. It's there. Boom. The Porsche. Boom. The company. My car is boom. So I want to encourage you all there tonight. Law of Attraction is God's attraction. God wanted us to have dominion over this earth. So why aren't you having dominion over earth? Because you, one thing that I heard Pastor Joseph Kingal say is doubt and fear are twin cousins from hell. <laughs> and I truly believe that if you have doubt and fear, you'll only block your own blessing. So take doubt and fear, take it out of your life and have faith and you already believe it that you've already received it. So receive your blessing today and thank God for your blessing because it's going to come tenfold. Why? He's God. He can give you anything. You're the only guy or person that's doubting your blessing in your life. Have a powerful week.